Hey everybody, I'm Damien, this is Austin Canto, and this is episode 3 of Chasing Moonbron. I have six more packets of Evolving Skies to open. I'm hoping this is we're going to have some success this time. We had a close call in the previous episode, go check that out if you haven't already done so. Yeah, let's get over to the desk, let's get these open and see if we can finally, or if we can get closer to pulling that all-important card. Here we are then folks, six more packets. Um, I'm kind of excited and a little bit nervous at the same time for opening these because it's starting to get expensive already. These packs are around about, I think about £10 here in the UK, which is, I mean, it's not cheap, but let's get started with a Umbreon pack to begin with. And I hope we can have some luck to get us started. I um, don't know if there is a card trick here. I'll... I'll You'll have to forgive me, I forget it all the time. I forget these card tricks, so let's go with let's just, just keep going from the beginning. So we've got Tentacle Start, Fletchlin, Hitmonchan, Hopip, Feebas, Hypno Reverse, which actually is quite a nice card, and a Medicham V. So there is it is a four card card trick. I'll put that to the side. We've had a V uh V card to begin with. I will sleeve it. But not the best start. Not the best start, not the worst. Um, everything else doesn't really matter to me. I've been sourcing these cards online and they're, uh, they're not cheap. Like I said, £10 a packet. It's going to get expensive, expensive, but it's all part of the fun, I guess. Code card if anybody wants it. Probably don't. I think it's, did I say four from the back? One, two, three, four. I think. Is that right? Yeah, burning energy. Right, okay. Let's get into it. So we've got a Dream Ball, Stormy Mountains, Baldor. I actually don't know many of these Pokemon. I know Lotad, uh, Ruffler, Pumpkaboo, a Pikachu, which I obviously do know, uh, Petalil, Smeagol's, that's an actual rare reverse, and Dialga. So, I don't know. You tell me if it's great. You tell me if they're good. Um, I will, for my own purposes, sleeve them so they can go in the binder and don't get damaged. But, um, yeah, we're already three packs in, and I've already I have some more on the way as well. I have some more cards on the way because I want to continue this. If it doesn't go well this time, at least we can continue with the uh, with the try, trying to get trying to get this very very expensive uh, Umbreon card. But yeah, um, here we go. Pack number three: Aroma Lady, Moon and, Moon and Sun Badge, Skull of the Flying Dragon, which sounds like something out of Magic: The Gathering. Love Disc, Bagon. Pumpkaboo again, and another tentacle. Imorga. So this is Rare Reverse, which is a Flapple. Uh, rare Reverse, and Milotic, another bust. At £10 pound a packet, it's not cheap, is it? Um, but it's all part of the fun. It's all part of the fun. Throw you away, nobody cares about them. One, two, three, four. Get rid of the energy, and our Treasure Energy. Digging Gloves, uh, Palpitoad, Wobbuffet, uh, Rog and Roller, Rufflet, uh, Dwebble, Nicket. Now we're getting to the Magic Hour. Gossifleur Reverse. And Emilotic again. <sighs> Crikey. So second class pack already. I'm flying through these because I don't, I don't want to make it a boring series. I just want you to see if we can get these, but it's... Um, just finding people who are selling the packs online for a reasonable price is actually quite difficult, so you kind of have to buy them on bundles. If you use it, sites like eBay, like I have been doing here in the UK, um, it's probably one of the best ways, to be quite honest with you. Um, otherwise, you're risking trying to find the vending machines. There's vending machines selling at RRP, but I don't live near an official Pokemon um, card vending machine. There's obviously third party ones, but they, they tend to be slightly above RRP anyway, and they don't tend to have um, evolving skies and the, and the pre, it's mostly just the cheap stuff that you can get at five pound a packet instead of like four pound a packet. So our first reversing pack, second to last pack is Flaugers, never heard of you, and a Talonflame, which is a cool card, but again, of no interest to me. Episode three, final pack, six packs. Let's, fingers crossed, touch wood as well. We're gonna get something good. We're already starting with a fluff. Uh, Rufflet. And anyone who wants that code card, be my guest. One, two, three, four. 
energy. See you later. Okay. I, can't, I, had, I didn't have a good feeling before this video anyway. So Moon and Sun badge, Scroll of the Flying Dragon, Snow Leaf badge, uh, Rufflet, Dwevel, Nicket, Cryogonal, Teddy Ursa. I'm not going to hope for this. SP on VMAX. We'll take it. But it feels like I feels like I'm getting closer. It feels like I'm getting closer. I have an order, like I said, coming in, but it's not what we wanted. We'll probably end up with all I'll probably end up with most of the evolutions and not pick up the one that I want, but SP on VMAX. Out of six packs. 60 quid down the drain. You tell me. See you in the next one.